class we are going to talk on lesson number 14th of class 6 that is tense here there are two exercises given in this book many students are asking for the answers and explanation of this uh, exercise so i'll be discussing today exercise a of this chapter that is tense okay so here in this uh, uh, page okay you can take page number 81 of your book or you can get explanation here also i'm giving so only you have to find out what types of tenses is being used in the given sentence okay identify the tense in these sentence here the first sentence is they climbed up and down the hill quite fast First of all, try to pick up the verb given in a sentence. What is verb? If you will see, so you can find out that the verb is climbed. It is the second form of climb. So the second form of the verb is only used in simple past tense. So it is simple past. Second, he swung his bat and hit the wicket keeper first of all there are two words hit is also a, ver a verb given here swing and hit so swing which is the second form of the word swing that is what it means move okay so he moved his bat and hit the wicket keeper so again second form of the verb is being used here so that is what simple past Question 3. The tennis bat lies broken on the coach. Tennis bat lies broken. Lies is somewhere verb and then after broken is given third form of the verb. So that is why present perfect has been used. Okay, after that. Okay, let me. Question number 4. Question number four is what? Just wait. Question number four. Okay, four is third is done. Now fourth is uh, my exam. Uh, my examinations will start in next week. So will start is given. You can see that will start. Will start means future. We are talking about future so when it will start it will start in the next week that the next week will come when in future so future indefinite is used here you can write future indefinite or simple future tense question number six the stale food tasted terrible the stale food tasted tasted second form of the verb v2 has been used so it's very simple again simple past then the next is Rohit is honest he doesn't lie is and doesn't Rohit plus is that you you know that it is simple present and then after doesn't doesn't is what it is the negative form of simple present so simply it is used simple present here it's very easy now question number eight that is the last uh, uh, point of this uh, exercise yeah so we made apple pie for breakfast we made again verb to simple past so in this way students we had been uh, we have been completed exercise a in the next class i will try to complete exercise b of this uh, lesson so till that time students thank you so much and have a nice day i hope that the class is somewhere understood by you all thank you so much